Hi, I'm Andy Webb from the Money Advice Service. Now, if you're going away on a holiday, you're probably really excited, you've probably been saving up for a long time for this and really looking forward to go. But one thing you shouldn't leave to the last minute is your travel money. Because if you do this, you're going to get stung and it's going to cost you a lot, lot more for your holiday than you expected. Now, one of the worst ways to buy things abroad is with your debit or credit card. There are all sorts of hidden fees you probably aren't aware of, whether that's paying for your paella or just taking cash out of an ATM, you will probably get charged. There are a few cards that don't do this, so do some research and see if you can get one of these before you go. But if you can, avoid using your normal bank card because you will be paying. Of course, it's always nice to have some cash with you as well. And if you do leave this to the last minute, if you get this at the airport, well, that's probably the worst exchange rate you're going to get. Even if it says fee-free exchange, no commission, there's still going to be some extra charges you don't see. Now, to get the best rate, you need to order this in advance. There are search engines, comparison sites online, which you can go into, type in the currency that you're after, how much you want, and they'll display how much you'll get in exchange. Now, if you can pick them up from somewhere nearby, that's often the cheapest way, but even getting them sent in the post will save you some money. And if it really is the last minute, then you can order in advance to collect it at the airport. And that's much better than just rocking up and getting that cash. One last thing to think about when you are abroad, and if you are paying by card, and it is one of those fantastic ones that don't charge you at all, always pay in the local currency. Because if you choose to pay in pounds, then you're paying on their exchange rate. And that's not going to be as good as the one that you get from your specialist travel card. For more information on all of this, head to moneyadviceservice.org.uk forward slash travel money.